pleased to introduce you today to our project, Helping Drive Energy Transition in the Maritime Sector. The project entails the development of the design concept for a floating hydrogen production storage barge, which would generate hydrogen via electrolysis from renewable energy. This could include solar and offshore or onshore wind, which could be sourced from the national grid or directly from local generation projects when they become available. The hydrogen would then be provided as a clean fuel for vessels and port consumers. The project is being developed by a consortium of companies led by Longitude Engineering, part of the Aqualis Braemar LOC Group, together with Aqualis Braemar LOC London, Long Green Hydrogen Solutions and Pool Harbour Commissioners. Using Pool Harbour as a case study, the objective is to design a concept which can be easily translated and deployed to ports and harbours around the world, providing a simple, cost-effective and green solution to maritime decarbonisation. Carbon emissions in the maritime sector are still growing year on year as the industry continues to grow. Therefore, the decarbonisation of the sector has an important role to play in the global race to net zero. Hydrogen and hydrogen-based fuels are amongst the most promising fuels for the decarbonisation of the maritime sector. However, barriers to the widespread deployment still exist. At the forefront of these is the lack of a comprehensive network of green hydrogen production and distribution, without which it is difficult for vessel owners and operators and port authorities to justify a decision to transition to green hydrogen fuel for their vessels and port consumers. The purpose of the Green Hydrogen Barge project is to design a concept that can be rapidly deployed in ports and harbours around the world and provide the certainty to port authorities and other maritime sectors to transition to hydrogen fuels for their consumers without the need for a significant shoreside infrastructure or large scale and complex transportation of the gas. The project in essence will act as a techno-economic analysis exploring the feasibility of green hydrogen as an alternative fuel to power ships. It will demonstrate the opportunity and commercial viability of the fuel's emission-free route to market, harnessing clean energy from locally available resources, converting it to hydrogen via electrolysis, storing it at a port, and finally transferring it to bunkering vessels. We're really pleased to be working with Pool Harbour on this pilot innovation, whose involvement reflects the UK port's leading standpoint in evaluating port energy demand and establishing a route to decarbonisation. The project will be completed in March 2022, and the results of which will be shared with the UK Department of Transport and Innovate UK for immediate deployment. There is technology out there to decarbonise shipping, but so far the value chain to keep it clean from source to ship has not been defined. This project will do exactly that. Music